We're here today um, highlighting uh, the value of throw lines uh, in the role of saving people that might fall uh, into the water. We're also educating both students and local residents about the dangers of the waterways um, in our uh, beautiful community. The agencies that are working together on water safety and especially alcohol related water safety in Worcester uh, and river safety are coming together to make sure that wherever there's any black spots along the river here in Worcester uh, that we make sure we get a throw line there so that there's one accessible and it can easily be used should it be needed. Going close to the river bank particularly when it's dark and wet and windy it's very difficult to know where the edge of the water begins and where the edge of the land ends and a lot of people just slip into the water accidentally. If you actually see something like that happen it's important not to make yourself a casualty at the same time do not try and enter the water and try and rescue the person, try and attract their attention, see if you can find something, reach them with a throw rope or a life buoy, or try and make them swim towards somewhere of safety. See if you can find something to uh, throw to them, as I say there may be a life buoy or something else that floats, an old cushion, and try and prevent them from panicking whilst they're in the water. It's particularly important to try and get other help, to try and raise attention, shout and make as much noise as possible, try and attract passers-by, ring the emergency services, make sure you know where you are, tell them the exact location, and uh, just also then to try and reinsure the, the person in the water. That incident, uh, the particular incident with Tom and other incidents have, have resonated with, with all of us and it's meant that all agencies really want to work together now to prevent something like that happening again. 20% uh, of our uh, victims that do drown have alcohol in their system or substance in their system so it's a really significant issue and here in Worcester unfortunately the students are having to cross the river to return to the hall of the residence after a night out so it is a significant risk. Um, so it's important that we educate students, it's important that we have things like throw lines in place so that if something does happen, if there's another tragedy on the cars, that there's, there's the tools and mechaniz mechanisms in place to be able to stop that to happen. So we're out educating, we're out ensuring that there is the right safety kit in place and we're also out ensuring that people know what to do when the worst does happen.